What is going on, everybody? It is me, your boy Perucci. We are back with another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle. In today's Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video, um, we are going to be doing um, Cell Max, the Red Zone stage in particular, not the regular Cell Max thing that we usually been struggling with. But um, yeah, Red Zone Cell Max that I still have missions to complete. Well, I had missions to complete that I've already completed this quite a while ago already. But um, one more thing too is, guys, um, I kind of got a little upset at the beginning that I, I got clapped because I saw the freaking uh, super tech from there. I don't know. I didn't wait. I didn't even see that. I thought this guy was going to be able to survive it. But then you, you'll see what happens. And then I have to pause real quickly because I did get another freaking video uh, up and going. And I'm like, bro, oh, my. Yeah, you see, dude, I got like, dude, I thought he was going to be taking like freaking double digits. And I'm like, oh, my freaking God, dude. And then here I got freaking annoyed. And I'm like, oh, yep, we're freaking dead. But then we have the re we have the revive, which I think obviously I think. The record the recording of this is actually gonna be kind of weird because I pause uh, real quickly. I probably should have just done this in one take, but um, whatever. Um, you know what? I I'll try to make it work. But yeah, revive happening right now. Um, pretty dope, honestly. And then I probably should have just kept my mouth shut so we could like hear the music and whatnot. But whatever. I'm just gonna talk over it. But I think I do have my active skills. Like the animations are like, you know, that we could see the animations. On Indeed, we do have the freaking animations all activated here. I was like, dude, I'm like, I'm pretty sure I had it on. And then I'm like, why they didn't want the intros activated all from there? But obviously, we didn't have an intro uh, character that we had there. But dude, here, oh, I was a bit annoyed that I wasn't able to get freaking, what's it called? Uh, an ATK super tech with freaking Rose. But whatever. I mean, here we're tech already. So I'm like, oh, it shouldn't really matter too much since, you know, or type advantage, and then I mean, maybe in the next uh rotation when we uh or next not in the next next rotation, but like you know, two rotations afterwards, we might have to worry about that, but uh, not really at all. And then we, of course, we have the freaking the one of the goats freaking um LR um LR final form Kuro, which of course gives me doing massive damage, but sadly, I didn't get an ultimate super attack either. Which, if you guys don't know, in his ultimate super attack, he stacks attack. I think it's no, I think it just raises attack, it doesn't like greatly raise attack, but yeah, um, here this guy's gonna do his thing, I think. This was during the time, or this is during the time my what's call it? My what's call My final form Kuro is just like at a uh, 99%. So I feel like he should be doing a good amount of crits, which I would hope he does, or at least a good amount of crits, or maybe like attack power, maybe some uh, raw defensive power from just like doing um, normal attacks, right? Which he's gonna probably do right there, and of course right there. But yeah, I think we're oh, and then we get another additional two attack. But guys, I didn't say I don't think I said this in the beginning because I was actually kind of rushing it because of the fact that we have a freaking revive an, uh, animation going on. Because dude, I think this was my first attempt. I, I want to say this was my first attempt doing this, and then I was like, kind of like I said, I was kind of annoyed that happened. I'm like, dude, are you freaking kidding me, dude? That that literally just happened, and then boom, we, we got the revive. I forgot freaking um that El Armando Kuro has a revive, but I mean, now that it's gone, um whatever. And then I'm like, ooh, actually this is perfect here. I think. Yeah, I could have probably put on um, what's it called, Final Form Kura or Metal Kura at the last slot uh, to do his active skill, but then I'm like, oh, we probably it would be a better use if we could use it in the next road uh, whenever he comes back again, since if we're floating him off. And I mean, sure, he probably won't be not probably he won't be type advantage to be or not type advantage, but you know what I mean. Like he would be neutral or like not at a, not be advantage uh, against freaking what's it called, the Cell Max. But um, it's whatever because like of course he does damage. But then uh, he does heal as well too during his uh, active skills. I'm like, yeah, I think I probably want to save that. And hang thankfully, uh, my merge of muscle, even though he's only at 55%, but we still have the 80% damage reduction activated since we're just getting him in the first turn. So yeah, that's that. And then this uh, merge of muscle, I don't know why he didn't do it like at least <laughs> attack or something, but whatever. I mean, we, at least we're getting a stack there. And then this guy is only doing two point. Dude, I feel like he will be doing much more damage if I was like, what's, if I gave him like a freaking what's we call it like the. The dupes that I have in my freaking collection into like a hidden potential system, but there's no point. I mean, I could probably do that right now because there is no need for me to, uh, what's it called, to have him like uh, unawakened you know, or have him awaken to an LR. Unless, like, whenever that happens, then yeah, I'll definitely, what's it called, it like reverse him back, right? Here, um, this guy's doing another super tech up. I think this might actually hurt us a bit. I think it's gonna do like freaking what? Oh no, it only does double. I thought it was gonna do like at least what? Like a hundred thousand uh, damage or two hundred thousand damage, but no. Okay, we actually we didn't take that much damage. And then of course, uh, thanks to the chi light, we're gonna be able to freaking what's gonna call it to tell what uh, where the super attacks are gonna be uh, landing. And then I'm here. I, I was like praying that freaking chi light was gonna be able to uh, dodge uh, evade the freaking super attack. And I think I'm pretty sure she does because if she didn't, then we might be at the brink of death. I think when I was like doing this stage, I'm like, yeah, we, if we don't dodge this, 
we probably be like <laughs> they'll probably be like 500,000 damage or maybe 600 or actually it might be even less or not less I mean more because we're not doing a super tag because I think when you do a super tag with Chila she greatly raises her defense thankfully here does uh, LR uh, int Goku Black Rose now uh, does three additional uh, or three super tags yeah not three I mean still three additional super no not three additional super tags that, that's way that's not the right way to uh, word that but yeah here and then look dude yeah, no, we would have been dead, actually. actually no, I thought we were going to be taking less from the, what's it called, the normal, but no, yeah, we most definitely would have been dead here. And then I think here, do I transform into, um, no, I do not transform into Merge Zamasu. Hmm, or I guess Corrupt Zamasu is the correct term because of, uh, obviously, he has the freaking half, like, purple face, and then because of the Kamehameha Blast that freaking Goku did to this guy. Um, I was thinking about putting, what's it called, Final Form Kura in the, in the first slot, but then I'm like, oh, he might take a bit of damage since, you know, he needs to uh, attack first to be able to get his uh, um, defense up, and I'm like, uh, let's not do that. And thankfully, I didn't because I think we probably still would have not taken as much damage either, since we, like I said, we we, we needed to attack first. I, I think that was my fear mostly. Is the first attack and uh, that first slot was gonna be a freaking what's to call it? Um, what's to call a super attack? But thankfully, it wasn't. I mean, I, I mean, even Zamasu would have been Zamasu would my Zamasu would have been able to tank that so. Here, actually, I was a bit worried. I think here we might take a bit of damage, even though we did get like a, a bit of stack attack and defense in. Um, but thankfully, only 35,000. Not too bad here. And then here, final, final form, Kuro's just going to do his thing. And then here, he's just going to blast him. I mean, not blast him to infinity because <laughs> we don't have uh, as many active uh, active skills. Link's activated with this guy. And then, <laughs> you, oh, you see? Yeah. Oh, I thought he I thought he was going to be perfectly fine, but no. Okay. I think here we might uh, do the, what's it called, Metal Kuro's active skill so we could recover a bit of health. Yep. <laughs> yep, like I said, uh, of course, thankfully I didn't use his active skill in the last the last time we saw him because I would have not been able to use it, of course. You can only use active skills once uh, when, you know, there's an active skill activated for a certain character. But yeah, uh, we did get a, a nice amount of heal, even though <laughs> it wouldn't really affect um, this merge the monster too much, since that this is the friend one and it's Rainbow 2. And then, of course, um, like here, if this guy is going to be doing... It will be helpful if he does multiple super attacks, because, of course, he's going to be doing a lot of more damage. And then, even though he got the crit there, but it, it would have helped Goku Black to be able to finish the guy off, too. Even though Goku Black is guaranteed to do double super attacks if his key is... What was it? I think it's 19 or more, right? But yeah, um, not too bad, not too difficult run. I think this is my first or second attempt of doing this. And then here, <laughs> dude, that's how you know this is a long ago when there's freaking the Paranga Bowls is happening. I think this is happening during the freaking, what's it call it? Um, November celebration of freaking Super Saiyan 4 Goku, dude, which still happy I pulled that guy, the, the dupe of that guy, honestly, too. Uh, if you've seen my last, uh, my Christmas summons video, I guess. Yeah, I would say, or the 10 of auto summons. But yeah, guys, that's gonna be guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out, everyone.